Amigos and amigas, welcome to the final Cyrus video. Um, this is not a topic that I've been wanting to milk. It's not like I'm thinking out here and praying. Please, God, please, the YouTube gods, let a fellow content creator be a groomer so I can make a video out of it and I can make money out of it. It's not like I'm out here doing that. Like, if it happens, cool. I'll be celebrating your downfall. It's not like I actively want it, but it's just something that happens. The reason why I'm making this final video is to provide the final Cyrus video ever. And if you guys don't know what I'm talking about, I made two videos talking about how this guy got exposed for being a groomer for being EDP 2.0, for being a creep, for being a weirdo, and just all around being a fucking freak. And I've seen some people going around saying, well, it's not confirmed sensitive. And to that I say, if you were innocent, if you were clean and you knew you did nothing wrong, why would you number one admit to a via phone call? And number two, why would you private all of your videos? And a few weeks after this drama comes out, he finally deleted his YouTube channel. If you search it up, because I had it here, it'll show this. This channel does not exist. As you guys could see, I was subscribed to the channel. Would an innocent person do this? But if allegations came out against me, number one, I will reply to it. Number two, I will not be deleting 700 plus YouTube videos. And number three, I will not delete my channel if I get Got falsely accused you want to know why because that makes you look even worse you pretty much confirmed it you pretty much admitted to it not only via phone call but just by default if you delete your whole channel do you actually think people are gonna be like you know that cyrus guy you know he deleted everything he changed his phone number he ghosted all of his friends on youtube you know what i think he's innocent <laughs> You have to be a special kind of retard in order to believe that Cyrus is innocent. I love that if you go to his Wikitubia or whatever the fuck it's called, it says, warning, this article, Cyrus, may contain material that is disturbing such as grooming. <laughs> this was someone who's gonna turn 20 years old in a few months. Imagine being 20, being successful and doing all of this stupid shit. Like, dude, you had money, you had fame, you had clout, and this is what you do with it? Fun fact, I don't have any screenshots to back this up, so you just have to believe me. But a few days prior to all of this going down, I made a video on the YouTuber Pointless. Me and him are cool. There's no beef or anything. But Cyrus left a comment just saying, LOL. I know that Cyrus is probably watching. I doubt he's offline truly. If you're watching, look who got the last laugh. I'm laughing at you. I'm laughing at your downfall. You thought you were funny leaving that comment. LOL sensitive. At least I'm not a fucking pedophile. At least I'm not a fucking groomer. <laughs> <laughs> at least I'm not here sending snapchats to people who look like they're 12 or 13. I don't know why he left that comment. Looking back, it's pretty funny. And looking back, I wish I would have gotten a screenshot of it. We're smoking that Cyrus pack and I'm glad he's gone. And if he comes back, I'll be there and I'll talk about it. Because we cannot let this happen. We have to put a stop to it. We need to put a stop to content creators being fucking pedophiles. Things and just letting it slip by opening a new channel. If I see Cyrus on Instagram, on TikTok, on YouTube, on fucking Tumblr with his weird fantasies, I will be there. I will be there to expose him and call him out and make money while I'm doing it, you know? And this is like his legacy. When people think back of this YouTuber with almost 2 million subscribers, they're gonna be like, oh, Cyrus? Oh, the groomer. Like, your family's gonna see this when they look it up. Your mama, if you have any. Your dad, if you have any. This is just bad. This is embarrassing. Cyrus is completely gone. He's not on YouTube. Can't get to him. But I'm pretty sure he still watches the videos about him. I know that if I get exposed, I will definitely be searching my YouTube name every single day. We're, uh, we're never gonna see him again. And I think that's for the best. And with that said, thank you so much for watching. I love you subscribe like and i'll see you tomorrow with a brand new video right peace out